Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. And uh, as, it, as you can see, none of my videos are edited anyway, so any mistakes uh, are just, they just happen, so it's part of life, no big deal. This next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. The turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. There. If you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test on your own recognizance. Oops, I cut her off there, didn't I? I solved that test too quickly. The aerial faith plate in here is sending a distress signal. You broke it, didn't you? There. Try it now. What happened, right? I was just lying there? You thought I was done? Hmm. This plate must not be calibrated to someone of your... generousness. I'll add a few zeros to the maximum weight. You look great, by the way. Very healthy. Try it now. Big bird, right? Couldn't believe it either. You seem to have defeated its load-bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. Uh, so, first thing you need is the switch. Right there, so you put the portal there. Keep that one place. She can shoot through it. Now you just need that one to get over there to get the box. While keeping that portal in place again. box to there, place the next portal there, get over there, all while keeping the same portal here the same. Look at you, sailing through the air majestically, now like an you eagle, it. piloting a blimp. There you go. Enjoy this next test. I'm going to go to the surface. It's a beautiful day out. Yesterday I saw a deer. If you solve this next test, maybe I'll let you ride an elevator all the way there up to the break room. The portal there on and the I'll tell one. you about the time I saw a deer again. And hop down. Jump through. Pick up this guy. Take the portal there. This one I'm not going to do it, but if you do it 70 seconds or less, you get an achievement, which is pretty cool. It takes practice. I'll just wait to do it that fast. And you can wait here and get this box. Come down here. Knock the other one off. Place the 
photo there. Pick up the box again. Go for another ride. There's one there. Go for another ride. To the exit. That's how you do it. It's not 70 seconds for sure, but. Well, you close. passed the test. I didn't see the deer today. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more test subjects than I'll ever need. Yeah, and I already got the achievement for that 70 second or less, but uh, I'm sure I didn't make the time. I kind of messed up on it, but oh well. Gives me an idea how to do it. These bridges are made from natural light that I pump in from the surface. If you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing outside with the sun shining on your face. It would also set your hair on fire, so don't actually do it. Here, grab the box. And you want the beam to come that way. Hit it on the switch. You want to get out of here, obviously, so you can place the portal there. There, and you're done. Excellent. You're a predator, and these tests are your prey. Speaking of which, I was researching sharks for an upcoming test. Do you know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? Did you guess sharks? Because that's wrong. The correct answer is nobody. Nobody but you is that pointlessly cruel. Good news. I figured out what to do with all the money I save recycling your one room full of air. When you die, I'm going to laminate your skeleton and pose you in the lobby. That way future generations can learn from you how not to have your unfortunate bone structure. Perfect. The door's malfunctioning. I guess somebody's going to have to repair that too. No, okay. don't get up. I'll be right back. Don't touch anything. Where's our friend Wheatley and the birds? Hey! Hey! Up here! I found some bird eggs up here. Just dropped them into the door mechanism. Shut it right down. I ah! Bird! 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 There they are. Okay. That's probably the bird in it that laid the eggs. Livid. Okay, look, the point is, we're going to break out of here. All right, very soon, I promise. I promise. I just have to figure out how to break us out of here. Here she comes! Keep te Just keep testing! Remember, you never saw me! Never saw me! I went and spoke with the door mainframe. Let's just uh, say he won't be, there. well, living anymore. Portal here. Anyway, back to testing. Portal there. You might go across and get there. We'll get back over here. Place it on there. Put the switch. Gather the box. Go over here. And then place one there. Get across to the end. Well done. In fact, you did so well, I'm going to note this on your file in the commendation section. Oh, there's lots of room here. Did well. Enough. This next test involves turrets. You remember them, right? They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh wait, that's you in five seconds. Good luck.
here. To maintain a constant testing cycle, I simulate daylight at all hours and add adrenal vapor to your oxygen supply. So you may be confused about the passage of time. The point is, yesterday was your birthday. I thought you'd want to know. And the way I solve this one is I grab this, I collect these two, place a portal right there, and then about another one where. Right you know there. how I'm going to live forever, but you're going to be dead in 60 years. Well, I've been working on a belated birthday present for you. Well, more of a belated birthday medical procedure. Well, technically, it's a medical experiment. What's important is it's a present. That jumpsuit you're wearing looks stupid. That's not me talking. It's right here in your file. On other people it looks fine. But right here a scientist has noted that on you it looks stupid. Well, what does a neck-bearded old engineer know about fashion? He probably... Oh, wait. It's a she. Still, what does she know? Oh wait, it says she has a medical degree. In fashion. From France. Aren't you still there? I'm going through the list of test subjects in cryogenic storage. I managed to find two with your last name. A man and a woman. So that's interesting. It's a small world. Surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise. So I'll just give you a hint. It involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. So here is where another Ratman area is. I'll show you how to get to that. Let's first kill these guys. <laughs> 